Hello, and welcome to the second instalment of the Test Modeler Quick Start Web Automation Tutorial Series. Now we've created our Quick Start Web project, we're going to come in and create a model. Now to do that, we're going to use our magento.testmodeler.io demo website, and we're also going to use our testmodeler.io scanner. The scanner is a web extension that you add to your Chrome browser, and what it allows you to do is to come in and scan the different elements of your web page that you want to automate. Once we've scanned everything we need to scan, we can come through, hit pause, and upload this into our workspace. As we upload this, we can select if we want to create a model automatically. I'm going to leave this option selected for now, and upload this into my workspace. Upon upload, we've created three items within our workspace. First, we have the object identifiers for the page, then we have our automation code for the page, and then we have our model for our customer login page. If we open that up, you'll see that we've created an initial model of our customer login page. In the next installment, we'll be going through how to edit this model and then generate and run some tests.